I'm Alexander and this is my project. Grab your large pad of paper. Cut the paper into the following patterns. If your paper is not large enough, tape multiple pieces together. Pin the patterns to the fabric and cut around them, leaving about half an inch around the edges. Choose a pattern you would like to go on the long arms. I chose a simple one button look to give a goofy almost animated personality. Sew the buttons onto the arms in whatever pattern you see fit. Make sure to leave half an inch for it when you're ready to sew it together. Sew the arms together with the good side of the fabric on the inside. Leave the top of the arm open and turn it inside out. Repeat the same process for the long arms. Grab all your arms, poly pellets, and polyfill. Fill the bottom of the long arms with the poly pellets and sew it at the base. Then fill the rest of the arm with the polyfill. Finish by sewing the arm shut. Fill all 8 short arms completely with polyfill and sew them shut. Sew both fins along the curved edge, flip it inside out, stuff it, then sew it closed. Take your two head pieces and sandwich the fins between them. Sew all 4 parts together and turn it inside out. Leave the bottom open for stuffing. Sew all the arms to the body fabric. Sew both ends of the body fabric together so that you have an odd looking tentacle huda skirt. Insert the headpiece into the huda skirt and sew around the perimeter. Fold a piece of paper in half and draw the basic shape of a heart. Cut it out and unfold it. Repeat the process three times. Insert all three heart into the main body of the pillow when you are stuffing it. Take your booty piece and hand sew it onto the bottom of the body to complete the main squid. I considered many designs for fabric eyes. But eventually decided of Coraline button eyes. Take your 3-inch buttons and sew them into place. 